Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Kujo, and I'm here to bring out some exciting gameplay of this awesome game I've been addicted to for the last couple of days called Chivalry, okay? This game is the most legit, I guess you can't call it like FPS shooter, I guess it would be more of a um, first person melee brawler. This puts you back in the days of King Arthur, Dungeons and Dragons, and you just go and tear people up. I'm sitting here running around with the Claymore. I'm in part of the Vanguard class. This game is absolutely amazing. You got three classes. You got Vanguard, you got your standard um, armored class, um, you have archers, and then you got knights. Um, everybody has their own different types of weapon in part of their class. Only um, the middle tier guys can carry shields. A lot of the heavier other dudes um, pick up swords and uh, short blades and things like that. I have had so much fun with this game. Those battles are massively large. Maps are also just as large. I think what makes the maps feel really large is the fact that there's no vehicles or anything close by. And depending on what class that you are determines how much speed you have as far as running because you get encumbered with weight and armor and stuff that you got on um, the servers hold up to 32 players max I haven't seen any 64 people but when you get into a 32 player room and it's a game like this what's going on right now in free-for-all it is an absolute clusterfuck of madness they also have different types of game types in this game um, you have your typical team deathmatch, standard deathmatch, and then you got a bunch of objective games. Uh, and some of the objective games they have where you have to like, you know, push a cart and blow things up or get into a castle and things like that. They definitely did a really good job with this game. Um, I also like all of the stuff that they have on the Steam Workshop as far as mods. The mods seem really cool. There's this one mod that they have on there where they have replicated the Red Wedding um, ballroom from Game of Thrones and they just let you duke it out on there. It is fucking awesome. Uh, here we go. I'm running down here in some team deathmatch right here. I'm running around with Scumbag911. You'll notice him later on in the clip because he's running around with a green diamond. You saw just a brief glimpse of it right there. Um, one of the key things that you want to make sure that you try to focus on when you're playing this game is that the game is so quick at times when you're clustered, like when you're fighting a bunch of combatants like this, it gets so quick that you want to make sure that you try to parry and time those correctly. If you parry wrong, you end up keeping your sword up longer than you should because there's no contact with another weapon, and it leaves your whole body exposed where dudes can just cut you in half and, and get you crazy. This game is quite graphic. You can decapitate people and pale them. If you have heavy axes when you're in a knight class and you got somebody that doesn't have any armor, like an archer or anything like that, you can literally split their body in half. I mean, it is freaking balls awesome. I really love this game. I would really recommend it for somebody that's trying to do a little bit different with their first person shooter games or is looking for a change because this game not only has a lot of action, it's a lot of fun, it's very addicting, and the replayability is just super high. Um, it, if you end up getting one of your boys to pick up this game and you guys can go at it together, holy shit balls! It is going to be the most fun that you can throw 14 bucks at. Steam currently has it at 30, but you can find deals on like G2A and things like that where you can find it cheaper. I found a bundle that had all the DLC and everything on there, and I got it for about 12 bucks after tax on G2A. So check it out. The game's so much fun. I hope you guys enjoyed some of this gameplay. Um, I, I just can't reiterate how much fun this game is. It is, it is just, it, it, I, I just can't, I, I, I'm just stuttering, just trying to spit the words out about how amazing this game is. It's highly underrated. It flew under my radar and I ended up finding it because a boy was, my buddy 911 here was telling me about it and he said, you got to pick this up. This game is freaking awesome as hell. And it really is. I have enjoyed every single minute of it. Um, just for the replayability and the most fun that I've had with this thing, I gotta give this thing a 9 out of 10, man. This game is fun as shit. Pick it up, try it out, play it. If not, see if you can find a demo of it and try it out. I guarantee you're gonna be in love with it. Check us out online, facebook.com slash groups slash scum nation. This is for you, 911. Agatha!